All right, so good morning from Seoul, South Korea. It's a bit of a lazy weekend today, a slow start. Sam was watching baseball, so I've been waiting for him to be ready. Yeah, my team <laughs> lost. The Cubs lost wong, today, wong. so I'm a little depressed. <laughs> But anyway, today we're kind of doing brunch. So we're at Cafe Bene, which is one of our favorite coffee chains. And Cafe Bene is huge in Korea. Like a few years back, they had close to a thousand branches spread out across the country. So it's super popular. Um, so yeah, we're here to have some drinks, some food, and we'll be showing you that as soon as it arrives. So funny story. Originally, we came here because we wanted to eat their gelato waffle because when we used to live in Korea, that's what we would get every single time. And their waffles are so good because they're all like caramelized and fluffy and they're just amazing. So we came, we placed our order, and then we noticed like the buzzy thing, like it was calling us back right away and we're like, wow, our food's really, really <laughs> fast. But no, I go downstairs and the guy's like, waffle, impossible. So I guess, I don't know, they were out of dough or maybe something happened. So we had to change up our order. So I'll show you what we got instead. And I think it still looks good. It's not going to be gelato yeah, waffle. We're, but... we're, we're still getting mm -hmm. one of their top specialties here, which is mm -hmm. their gelato. And we're getting nokcha. the, the, the nokcha green tea flavor. Yes. And what else do we have? And we have a hot cheese bagel with jalapeno. That looks That's pretty so good. good. You can see the cheese oozing out. Yeah. And then this, I'm pretty sure is a new product. I haven't seen it before on the menu. It said uh, topping pastry. So we've got some kind of pastry here with whipped cream, and chocolate powder. It's definitely big. Yeah. And a drink. Vanilla latte. All right, Sam, what are you starting with? <sighs> Going for the good stuff. Going the for gelato. the green tea gelato. Ooh la la. Oh, wow. Look at that. Oh mm. man, that's so good. Mm -hmm. Such a rich, rich green tea flavor. Yeah. All right, what's next? What are you gonna get into? How about right. your coffee? Yeah, what am I trying to do? coffee. Vanilla latte. My vanilla latte, so let's rip off the top here. Try that. Take the lid off. Show us how frothy it is. Oh, Come yeah. on. Point. <laughs> so otherwise, you can't even see it. <laughs> the viewers want to see. Okay, frothy. Creamy. Very frothy. How is that? It's a good latte. Yeah. Although it doesn't have that strong of a vanilla taste, mm -hmm. but really creamy, really good. All right, so we're going to share the bagel. Cutting that in half. Oh, yeah. Man, That's look at the cream cheese. It's like oozing stuff. out. Oh, wow. It's totally oozing out. Whoa. Totally oozing out. So this one in the middle, it has cream cheese, but they also put like, I guess a regular mozza cheese and melted it on top of the cream cheese so it's like decadence. Look at how cheesy that is. I <laughs> know. And you also see the chunks of jalapeno, so. It's like how thick that thing That is. might be. It's a behemoth. It's, mm. it's a behemoth. Mm. Is it good? Yeah. <laughs> mm, it's really nice. So how would you describe it? Super cheesy with a bit of a kick. So Sam is going to attack the topping pastry yeah. before it melts. Yeah, time to attack this big bad boy. So I think they put some whipping cream and cocoa powder on. Yeah. I'm not entirely sure. It's slowly losing its shape and just oh, wow. running down the side. Just from cutting it, it kind of has the consistency of a cinnamon bun. Ooh. So let's try that here. Mm. Oh wow. Okay, yeah, that's definitely whipped cream yeah. with the cocoa on top. And the pastry itself, it looks like really big, but it's actually really kind of light. And fluffy. And bright, yeah, very light and fluffy. And it's perfect for putting this type of topping, like a whipped cream on top of yeah. it. Because it just, uh, it adds a lot to it. Is there is there anything in the pastry? Does it have raisins? Um, let's investigate it. Let's actually here. investigate that. I didn't get anything in my first Investigative bite. Investigative eating. I don't think so, but it does yeah. have chocolate. It does appear to have yeah. chocolate on that. Chocolate is always a good thing. It's really good. Yeah. Nice and light. So, what's your favorite thing so far that we've ordered? Well, I mean, today? obviously the gelato, but I haven't, had, I haven't tried this one yet. So. The bagel? No, bagel's up next for me. Okay. Why don't I just take a bite right here? I'm gonna take one of yours. Go for it. Stealing yours. Mm. Oh, wow. I'm kind of glad we ordered something a little bit savory. Yeah. Mm. It's spicy too. I know. I'm feeling I know. that spice. I'm seeing that, yeah. 
This is this is really pleasant. Sometimes it's good when you know like because they didn't have the waffle. This is getting us out of I wouldn't say our comfort zone, but out of what yeah. we would normally order. It forced us to try something. Forced new. us to try some new things. We still decided to make the video, so yeah. we're rolling with it today. So we polished off all of that food. It was really good. The two items we liked the most were the jalapeno bagel mm -hmm. with green cheese and real cheese and also the green tea gelato. That was fantastic. So in terms of price point, it came to just under 20,000 won. So uh, I think it was actually, what was it, 19,000? Yeah. So that's mancuchon won. And roughly that's about 16 or 17 US dollars. Uh, not bad value, I mean we got three different food items and a really large drink. So it's not super cheap, but it's the kind of place that you want to come and relax and have a nice sweet treat, basically. Yeah, so if you guys come and check out Cafe Benny, make sure you get the waffle! Yes! <laughs> Demand <laughs> the waffle! <laughs> Alright. That's a wrap from Seoul. Ta-ta!